Hey, what's up? This is three, and you watching Hip Hop Wired. Stay locked. Salute. What are the circumstances that led me to get shot six times? Actually, that was in um, 2006, so, you know, that was uh, just, uh, you know, trying to live the street life and still be a rapper at the same time. You can't juggle both. You either got to pick one of the two, so that's what some situations that led to that. How have I not got such a big head and went Hollywood? Um, well, I've had two major deals that, unfortunately, I got dropped from both of those deals, not me being a talented artist or music-wise, but I just wasn't my time. Business wasn't done correctly. You had middlemen and people involved. And, um, you know, I was 18 with the first deal, 21 with the second. I'm 30 years old now, so that's a big scratch to get my third shot, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, over those years, and going through the obstacles that I went through, you know, you have to humble yourself. So, you know, just growth, you know, maturity, you know, just, uh, you know, life, having two daughters, um, you know, just having just a different outlook on life, reading a lot more, learning about God, you know, paying my tithes, you know, all those things that humble you. You know, people sometimes they protest for the wrong reasons. They, you know, they be down there and they give their man their camera phone. They like, I'm finna go up in one of their face and they record. That that ain't really, you know, when you protesting and you from the heart actually doing something and standing, you ain't worried about all that stuff. You know, so you know my city, they watched a lot of things on social media from it happening in other cities. So when it trickled down to Charlotte and actually happened there it, you know, woke people up actually to what's really going on in the world and show you that this can happen anywhere. I feel like an artist, you're gonna always be your biggest critic, you know, cause it may be some people in the studio or you have fans and people that actually listen to the music and they be like, man, this is dope or this is it. And me as an artist, I feel like it can be better. Like certain things I may come out with, I'd be like, I should have said that differently. So. I'll always be my biggest critic. I look forward to uh, being the first rapper that can be in three, four categories. You know, rap, R&B, pop, you know, best performer, you know. Uh, just to make history, you know, and uh, motivating the people. That's my, that's my first goal is to, you know, start a following and a generation or a revolution of uh, people who actually, you know, to follow me and, you know, uh, learn from my experiences and maybe hear my story and kind of learn from it, you know. It's a lot of people in the world that actually give up, they be talented, they have a real gift and they don't really see it. So, you know, sometimes hearing other people's experiences can uh, change other people.